since we're by Barney's, let's look at their window displays for the holiday season, shall we? I guess she's doing some ice carving. Oh, and this window's all ice too. Well, Home Depot was a bust for Christmas trees. There was hardly anything left. I guess that's what happens when you wait till the last minute. I'm gonna go to Bed Bath & Beyond now and see if they have anything. Well, Bed Bath & Beyond was a bust. So now I'm back in Queens and I'm gonna try the Home Depot near me because it's bigger. So they might have more left. And if there isn't anything there, then there's a Michaels. They might have something. Well, that Home Depot was a bus too. I don't need a nine foot tree. Maybe five foot, four foot, a little nugget of a tree. One last stop, Michaels. And then I'm hashtag over it. Yay, I found a four foot tree at Only Deals. It was on sale for nine dollars. And it has lights too, so that's cool. Now I'm going to go to Michael's and see if I can find some decorations for it. Ugh, I'm home. This rain is obnoxious. I found some cute decorations for the tree at Michael's. I'll show you those later. I am hangry, so I'm having a smoothie. Delicious. And I have an hour. I'm going to go to yoga. I venture back out into the rain. And in the meantime, I'm going to put together this tree. Let's see how cheap it is. What do you expect for $9? We'll make it beautiful. That's the thought that counts. There, it's actually not that bad. It's kind of cute. I need a tree skirt for it, so I think I'm gonna use a scarf. Creativity, life hack. If you don't have a tree skirt for a teeny tiny little tree, use a scarf and voila. Beautiful. So, what I got for decorations, I'm gonna do this after yoga tonight, so I'm gonna come home, maybe put a little music on, and decorate this tree. But I thought I'd show you what I got at Michael's. Everything was 60% off, bonus for waiting late to decorate. And I wanted to get things that were not like your traditional gaudy Christmas tree decorations, and I wanted to get things that were teeny tiny and small so I can store them because part of the challenge here is I don't have a lot of closet sp space so the little tree came in a teeny tiny little box that it'll go back in and then these decorations will go in a teeny tiny little box too so let's see what I got I got one two three four five of these Merry Minis Joy Mini Joy jo jo I can't speak French these are little mini ornaments. They are cute. There are six of them in here, I guess. And I got five of those, so what, that's 30 ornaments. And then I got these, there's 24 of them in there. They are wood stickers, and I'm not gonna use them as stickers, I'm gonna put twine around them so I can hang them up. And actually this is hemp cord that I found in the jewelry section. And then I got this ribbon. It is got little snowflakes on it. So there's a theme here, snowflakes. It's a snowflake tree in earthy natural colors. So we'll see what it looks like when it's done. I'm sure it'll be adorable. That's a look. What? 
It's raining, so I have to wear these dumb boots. Off to yoga! Let's get sweaty! Okay, copyright. Mute. I am back from hot yoga with Carlos, who is a vinyasa Nazi. Oh my god, I had to stop multiple times throughout the class because he is out of control. It was really good, but I am not in that shape, Carlos. Slow your roll. Anyway, I stopped at the grocery store, picked up a few things so I can have something to eat tonight because my refrigerator is empty. And now I'm going to listen to some Christmas music and assemble all of my snowflakes. I got some done. I have more to do. And yeah, so let's do this. And then I will show you the finished product. I got some ribbon on there. I think I'm gonna go on the YouTube and see how to make a bow to put on the top instead of a star. Bow topper. all of the snowflakes I bought so I have extra wood snowflakes if you need them let me know they were a great deal and they're super cheap it's cute it's cute it's cute I like it it turned out good I'm glad I did it the holiday spirit for a week and a half next year I will put the tree up after Thanksgiving or on Thanksgiving so it's up longer so I can enjoy it I'm kind of a Scrooge, so this is a huge step for me, putting up a tree. I don't think I've ever put up a tree, ever. When I lived in Madison, my roommates Jim and Tristan put up a tree, I did not participate. And my ex and I never put up a tree. Retail burnout, but oh well, tis the season. Alrighty, kids. Thanks for watching. Remember, daydreaming may leech reality. Have a good night, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Um, these are... I got several gifts purchased last night on my shopping extravaganza. I really only have to buy presents for me soon after you Oh, that's it. I successfully did my for me, so that's